Let's talk about other property for the magnet. If we freely suspended the magnet and make it move freely, it will always point to the north-south direction. As we said before, magnet has two poles, north pole and south pole. So the north pole will point to the north direction and the south pole will point to the south direction. This if we hang the magnet freely. Let us do an activity to prove this and see what happens. If we get the magnet and freely suspended it and leave it to move freely, we are going to find that the magnet will move, then it will stop to the north-south direction as you see. And if we make it move again and freely move again, it will always stop and point to the north south direction the north pole points to the north direction and the south pole points to the south direction okay let's talk about other property for the magnet the magnet as we said has two poles the like poles repel and the unlike poles attract Always when the north pole of the magnet getting close to the north pole of other suspended or any magnet, they will repel because they are both like. But if we get the north pole and put it close to the south pole, they will attract because different poles attract. This is other property for the magnet. Okay, let's see. As we say before, when we leave the magnet freely suspended and moving, it will move, then it will stop to the north-south direction. The north pole points to the north direction and the south pole points to the south direction. If we get another magnet and put the south pole close to the north pole, it will attract, as we see because they are different pools. But if we get the like pools, north and north, they are going to repel from each other. And this is a property for the magnet, natural property for it. Okay, as you see, the two like pools repel, not attract. Let's talk about other property. Number five, the pool and the magnet, sorry, the north, uh, the magnet and the magnetic field. Each magnet has a magnetic field around it, and the magnetic field is the effect of the magnet in the region around the magnet, as you see. And the, uh, and the magnetic field is the region where the magnetic force appear. As you see here, if we get a compass near to the, the magnet, the compass needle will swing and will move because we put the compass in the magnetic field of the magnet, but if we get it far from the magnet, the magnetic needle will not uh, move because it is out of the magnetic field of the magnet. So these are the five properties of the magnet. Thank you and see you next lesson.